All right, let's take a look at the markets this morning. So um, our new indicator, new strategy will be coming out to you guys. And uh, I want to go over that uh, with you this morning. So uh, we've had a couple good shorts here this morning. It's a really big short this morning that happened at 4 o'clock. Um, this is our new indicator and a new strategy. I'll go over the strategy also. Uh, what we can do is we have a strategy that you can use and turn on when there's momentum in the market uh, that will automatically put in your targets, your stops, and your trail for you. So here's this morning's action. Now you don't have to use a strategy. There's two parts of it. We have one, we have the indicator, which is a separate, uh, that can be used standalone by itself, or we have the strategy, which can be stand by alone by itself or used with the indicator. So totally up to you what you want to do. So we have the indicator and strategy. So what you're looking at right now is the indicator. The indicator, what it'll do is show the ATR. It's a continuous ATR that has my zones in it. Now, there are specific zones that work very well in many markets, and we look for the markets to retrace at or inside of these zones for continuation patterns. All right, so we have the indicator, and then we have the strategy. There we go. So the indicator, like I said, this is the indicator. It can be used standalone. We've had a sell right now. We have a sell inside the zone. We had a sell here. These arrows will automatically fire automatically. They will fire for you automatically when there is a sell setup. You can see that the S&P, the live field below this bar. A nice trade rolling right now. So a live fill would be right around 33, 39, 33. It's all the way down to 25 already. Eight S&P points right now that's working off of this sell setup. This one was a huge one here just recently. 46 all the way down, potential 23. So get over a 20-point S&P run there. And then here, 30 all the way down to your, what, 20, almost 26, so four S&P points, so 16 ticks. So you can use the indicator strategy alone by itself without the strategy. Okay, you can see how my zones are very well. If you have a red ATR, then we're looking for green, what's called WPT, trying to catch the rolling position traders, or I call counter trend traders. We wait for the green, Optic color speed bars that come in. Once the optic color speed bars come in, good morning, Thomas. Once they come in, we're looking for this arrow to print. Once this arrow prints, you have a high probability trade to the downside. So this would be set up, set up, stops would be just above the swing high, set up. Now what we can do is we can use automation to fire us in the trade. What does that mean? We can use a strategy that we have, okay? We can use a strategy to fire us in these trades. The strategy will fire these arrows also. It's already short, so it's not going short at this level. But we can use strategy to fire in to automatically pull us with the entries, our stops, and our trails. How can we do that? When's the best time to turn on this strategy then? So the strategy that we're, we're releasing everybody, we can run the indicator by itself, stand alone, or we can run the strategy. We know that the best time to trade this system is with trend. So how can we determine when the market's going to possibly go vertical? How can we determine when the market could go vertical on us and either get in as a standalone indicator like this with my zones, my cell zones, or how can we turn on a strategy like this to take advantage of the computer 
putting our entries in, putting our stops in, putting our trails in. We have a momentum indicator that comes with the system also that tells us when this possible move is going to happen. So before this big possible move right here, this big down possible move, before this big giant over 20 point move in the S&P this morning, we have an indicator called the momentum indicator that comes with the system in our workspace that lets us know when any market, any futures, any stocks, any forex, any currency is possibly going to go to a vertical move. The hardest part about trading, I don't care if you trade Elliott Wave, I don't care if you trade Fibonacci, whatever you trade, I don't care if you trade Stochastics, I don't care if you trade Divergence, it doesn't matter what you trade, there's thousands of indicators out there. If you don't know when a possible vertical move in the market is going to happen, you're going to get stopped out a lot because chop markets cannot be traded unless, in my opinion, you use market profile by itself. Other than that, all these thousands of indicators are absolutely worthless because you get into chop and you give all the monies back that you made in trend. Well, now we have an indicator with this algo that we're releasing that will show us when possible vertical moves like this happen, this and this. So what we have is we have this momentum indicator. This momentum indicator has my zones. I have three zones. And what these three zones tell us is, is that when we turn all six red, all six zones turn red. And let me show you here, vertical line, right there. So when all six zones turn red, six lines, there's three zones actually, so six lines, one, two, three, four, five, six. When all six turn red, then you possibly got a vertical movement. You can actually turn this algorithm on beside it, and they'll let it do the automated entries for you, for the, your entry, your stop, and your trails that you put in. So now this takes the guesswork out of when do I pull the trigger? Do I pull it here at this WPT? Do I pull it here with this WPT? Do I pull it here? Do I pull it here? Do I pull it here with Chart Trader? Well, you can use the automated strategy to pull yourself in at these levels. All right, because I have my built-in ATR and zone automatically built into my automation. So we can do that based upon momentum in the market because we're letting the momentum of market pull us in. So how is that beneficial to us? Well, it's beneficial if you have a day like even yesterday and the day before. This week has just been absolutely phenomenal with the system and strategy. If you look at yesterday, same thing happened to the upside. So yesterday morning, we turned six, all six green. Yesterday morning, right here. So if you look at yesterday, the momentum in the market came in and said, hey, we're possibly going a major vertical move in the market when we turned all six green right there. So what the automated strategy did, it picked up these buys and it trailed for you on your trail and also it kept your stops in on the way up. So yesterday, if you look at it, look at the automation. It caught these big moves because it kept inside of my ATR. So this was automatically put in, pulled in the market when you turn the strategy on. So what we can do now is we can, we can turn the automate, automated strategy on when we know there's a possibly vertical move in the market based upon our momentum indicator. So now instead of having to manually go in here and manually trying to put chart trader on at these levels and trying to put your stops in and hitting the, hitting the buy button, buying the ask or buying the market, whatever you like to do, the automation can pull you in by itself. So it doesn't work on the downside and the upside. It's equally, it doesn't matter. So if you look what happened the day before that, it's just been a phenomenal week with momentum. We had momentum. Momentum came in the market 
The day before that, with right here, we turned six red. So momentum cell setup. Automated algo can be turned on with target stops and trail after six red cell zone dots. Here it was. There's your vertical line. There's six. What we can do is we can turn on the strategy. Now the strategy, what it can do, this was at 3 o'clock into the close. It can be turned on. And as long as you stay below this ATR, this ATR, it has all these three zones. This is the outer ATR, three zones. And then it catches all the move to the downside. It caught this on the indicator, this one, this one, this one, this one, all the way into the close. So we can, we can put ourselves in a best position with momentum now using and using an automation automated strategy with momentum. All right, so our momentum chart can be used to let us know when there's a possible vertical move in the market, and then our automation can put us in with our stops, our targets, and our trail. Okay?